Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Dayton Raceway here on Monday. It is December the 19th, 2016. I'm going to look at featured 8th race from Dayton, but before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kit 5 for more selections from racetracks across the world. Today's 8th race from Dayton is the open handicap post positions 1 through 3 were drawn and race and post positions 4 through 8 were drawn. Field of 8 trotters traveling a mile per $15,000. There is a pick 3 that connects races 8 through 10. Exact to try super wagering, 10 cent super wagering. And I'm going to give you a straight 10 cent super this race. I'm going to go to the 3 horse, primed and powerful as a top pick. I'm going to go 3, 7, 8, 5. 3785 in a 10 cent super here. Um, if you uh, followed me uh, yesterday at for Saratoga, I did give out a 10 cent super straight for 92 bucks again, uh, the ticket return. So hopefully you played that. Um, but uh, this race, I'm going to go 3785. Number three, primed and powerful. Randy Tarps uh, is on the 7 to 2 shot here. Last time out at Dayton, last uh, on the 12th of December, non worth of 8,000 life. And the last four, horse finished second by four and three quarter quarter lengths that day. Horse needed the race, I think. Um, you know, just basically sat second all throughout. Didn't have the best closing kicks. Gets a better post position today, break, breaking from the three hole. I think this horse should be uh, on the improvement today. Watch out for this one. Start before in the open, handicap trot here, Dayton, the 5th of December. Horse finished fourth by four and a quarter lengths from the six hole. Horse went to lead, but lost it shortly afterwards. Sat second almost all throughout, and then got taken over in the, st in the stretch drive. Wasn't his day to win. And then the Dayton open handicap, 28th of uh, November. This horse finished fourth by three lengths. Just really weakened out of it. It wasn't his day to win at all that day also. Um, I think this horse will be on the improvement. He needed his last one um, just to get his legs moving again. He has a better pose vision. You know, he, he is facing some older horses here, this three-year-old gelding. A lot of these horses are a little older than him, but I think he should run a good one. His last win came over in Indiana at Hoosier. Um, it uh, non was a two uh, to four pair mutual horse one by neck. Just a very easy victory. Um, you know, I, I think this horse will have a good start here today. So to recap my bets for race number eight from Dayton, going to go with the three horse here, primed and powerful. Going to go three seven eight five three seven eight five. So good luck to all, and follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid Five. Good luck, everybody.